everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my January TBR, and I kind of hinted at this in my last video that I just uploaded um, two days ago uh, about my channel goals and how we're gonna try to change up the TBR format for this year and play around with a couple different things. I personally really like games and interactive TBR videos from booktube channels, um, and I'll link a couple of those that have really inspired this idea down below so that you can check out some more channels that do fun interactive TBR videos like this. Um, so I wanted to try a, a different way of doing TBRs and picking out my books, uh, and so I'm doing kind of like a dice game. Um, so I'll explain it here. <laughs> Basically I have a whiteboard where I write down 11 different books. Um, and each book kind of fits a different category. So a couple of the category examples are like recommendations from you all. So if, if you all are recommending something to me in the comments, uh, I am keeping track of that on Goodreads. So every time you post a book that I should read, I always put that on Goodreads. So you'll always see on these TBR videos, a recommendation from you all each month um, and a possibility to choose that book. And then I'm also having uh, one book for a, for a classic uh, so any kind of classics books that I want to read, um, I'm also including on this whiteboard. And then I have a couple of books that are already owned. So I did a huge book haul a couple weeks ago. So I have a ton of books to get through on my physical TBR. So a lot of those are going to be on this whiteboard. And then the must read books. So a video coming up is going to be 20 books I must read in 2020. Uh, I did this last year. I did 19 books that I had to read in 2019. And I loved it and I, I did it. I accomplished it. So I'm doing the same thing this year. And this is to just get through books that have been running on my TBR forever. So that's also going to be a category and I can always change up the categories. So this is not set in stone. Uh, that's why it's on the whiteboard. <laughs> Super easy to erase. Each book will take up a number um, and I'll kind of hold it up so that you can see. Um, so each book is going to take up a number where uh, if I roll a two, it's going to be the book that is on the number two spot. If I roll a six, it's going to be the six, etc. And each time I roll a number, uh, I erase the book that's currently taking up that number. I add it to my TBR for that month and I write a new book that fits that category. And so each of these different categories has a different color that you can see. Um, so that's how I'm going to try to choose my TBR. And let me know if you like this uh, or you hate it. <laughs> and I'll change it. <laughs> I'm just trying to experiment with a couple different ideas and um, fun ways to pick out books each month. I already mentioned that one of those categories is the subscriber recommendations from you all. Um, Another category is that classics, the already owned is that physical TBR, and then the must reads, that's going to be those 20 books I must read in 2020. Uh, the last category is a new release, so a, a release from that month. So January 2020, um, I chose a couple books that I was really excited for, and so that's also one of the categories. Um, so let's get started and see how this goes. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Let's start off this roll. As you can see, everything is color coded. So whatever I roll, I will read that book and then I will make a new book selection. All right, so that's a 10. So that is King of Scars. So here is the first book I will be reading. And now I will erase and put a new book in that spot. And I've chosen Muse of Nightmares to now replace King of Scars. So next roll. That is seven, so this savage song. So here is the second book I will be reading. And time to replace. And Dark Dawn has now replaced the seven spot. Nine, that is Oathbringer. It is part one and part two, the additions I have. So here is the third book I will be reading. Oh boy, this is looking like a big reading month so far. All right, so I did pick Gone Girl to replace uh, Oathbringer, uh, which is a shorter read since this is looking to be a very big book kind of month. <laughs> so here we go. Eight. So that is Vengeance Road. The fourth book I will be reading this month. All right, Crazy Rich Asians is now at place number eight. So next roll. 
to American Dirt, the new release. So I don't currently own this, but I will be buying it for next month to read. So American Dirt will also be on the TBR. Okay, now the new release is Seven Deadly Shadows. So let's keep it going. That is 11, so that is Gathering Blue. So Gathering Blue will be the sixth book that I read next month. Two more rolls. And the one that has now replaced Gathering Blue is I Know Who You Are by Alice Feeney. So here we go. 10, that's Muse of Nightmares. Muse of Nightmares will be the seventh book I will read next month. So let's do one more roll after I replace. And the next one that I have for number 10 now is All Our Wrongs Today. So last roll. Four, Cross Her Heart final book that I will be reading is the adult thriller Cross Her Heart, so I'm very excited about this one. Okay, so that actually worked out pretty well because these are a lot of the books that I would have chosen for my TBR even without this game. Uh, these are a lot of them that I was wanting to read next month anyway. Let's go through all of them again. So the first book that I rolled was King of Scars by Leigh Bardugo, so that's going to be one of the books that I read next month, followed by Oathbringer by Brandon Sanderson, which fits my adult fantasy reading goal, as well as catching up or completing series that I've started. Then I've also got This Savage Song by Victoria Schwab, which has been on my TBR forever and is one of my must-read books, as well as Vengeance Road by Erin Bowman, as well as Gathering Blue by Lois Lowry. Uh, Muse of Nightmares by Lainey Taylor, which is the sequel to Strange the Dreamer, which will help me complete that goal of completing series that I started. And then Cross Her Heart by Sarah Pinborough. And the last book is American Dirt by Janine Cummins, which is the new release book that I'll be reading for next month. I've already pre-ordered it, so I'm on top of it. I'm ready to go. I'm very excited for this one. This is one of my most anticipated of the entire year, so... It sounds like it's going to be a really great way to start off the month. So can't wait to do the wrap up and show you all what I think. And thank you all so much for watching. Definitely let me know your feedback about this style of TBR video in the comments down below. Did you like it? Was it fun to watch? What would you recommend for the future? So I love to hear from you guys. Thank you again so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it that thumbs up and subscribe. I release new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and until next time, bye.